Hi August. Hi. How are you? I'm very well, thank you. Wonderful. My name is Dr. Matt. I'm going to do your physical assessment today. So go ahead and tell me a little bit about you. What happened? So um, I have been told I have trigeminal neuralgia. Or, uh, I believe I have. Um, I get a sharp pain here in my ear. Okay. Um, it sometimes touches my eye and it's like flashes of pain. I've had it in my nose, um, my jaw and like the back of my throat. Mm. Sometimes I get it on the other side as well. Um, so that's obviously worrying me. And then I do have some tingling down one side of my back near my spine, which feels a bit like numbness. Okay. Are you having any pain in the back of the throat? Yeah. Okay. Is Do you have any pain right now? Or? I'm in no pain right now. So it comes and goes? Yeah. And you've been experiencing flare-ups, correct? Yeah. Okay. Are you having one right now? No. No. Uh, did you injure your head in no. recently? No. When I was a child, I did hit the side of my head here. I don't know if that's a cause, but yeah. Okay. Do you have any missing teeth? No. Okay. Do you know if you grind your teeth at night? I uh, clench my jaw. I don't grind. You clench your jaw a lot during the night or during the day? Night. Night. Um, and um, do you wear a mouth guard when you sleep? No, because I have uh, retainers for my teeth, so I can't put a mouth guard on, on top of that. Okay. And um, where do you feel the back pain? Is it more on the right or more on the left? On the left, like here. Okay. And the tingling sensation, does it go all the way down to your... No, it's like a strip. It feels like a strip on my back. Okay. And do you hear a clicking or a popping sound when you open your jaw? No. Okay. And have you had any... Uh, scans like a CT scan or an MRI recently? Yep, I had an MRI about three years ago. Okay. And it was clear, there was nothing there. Okay, so that's very reassuring. Are you experiencing any twitching of your eyes? No. Like, they're I just did, like I did, I did as you asked that question. Yes, yes, yes. Not normally. But involuntarily? Okay. Sometimes. Sometimes? Very rarely. Okay. <laughs> Are you feeling any twitching around your mouth sometimes? No. Okay. Um, yes, everything that you're describing uh, might be symptoms of um, trigeminal neuralgia, or you might have uh, TMJ, temporomandibular joint dysfunction. Although you're not, if you're not hearing any clicking or popping sound, um, let's go ahead and, and check and see what's going on. Do you have any history of hypertension? What's hypertension? Hypertension is high blood pressure. No. Okay. And are you having any pain right now? No. Okay. On a scale of 0 to 10, how would you rate your pain? 0 being no pain, 10 being? Like an 8. An 8. 8 to 10. Okay. And how would you describe the pain on the right side? Oh, it's like electric shock. Okay. And how would you describe the pain in the back? Numbness. It's not pain on my back, it's like numbness. It's numbness. Okay. Is it more in the middle or more on one side? On the left. More on one side. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and use that arm. Is that okay? Yeah. Okay, do you mind holding this for me, please? Thank you. Your blood pressure is a little bit elevated, 130 over 70. I would say it might be due to the pain that you're having. Okay. okay. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do a cranial nerve exam, um, do a very good face examination, check your uh, sensation, and also check your back, see what's going on there. Okay. Okay. 
Okay, August. So what I'm gonna do is check your facial sensation and also gently tap on your face. Let me know if you're feeling any kind of pain, okay? okay. Can you please open your jaw a little bit, a little bit more? Good. Good. Go ahead and close. Okay. Do you feel that? Yeah. Do you feel this? Yeah. And what about this? Yeah. Do you feel that equally on both sides? Yeah. Great. Okay. Now I'm going to check your sensation to cold. Can you please tell me where you feel this? Uh, left cheek. Good. Right cheek. Good. Chin. Good. Under my left eye. Good. Under my right eye. Good. Uh, forehead. Great. Okay. And now this will feel a little bit sharp. I'm just going to show you how it feels. And I will do the same thing on your face. Tell me where you feel this. Left cheek. Right cheek. Chin. Forehead. Tem left temple. Right temple. Good. Okay. I'm gonna go ahead and gently check your So this is the temporomandibular joint right here. It connects the, the, um, the jaw with the ear and also the upper jaw. And I'm not feeling any kind of inflammation. Okay. Any pain here behind the ears? No. Okay. Any pain here? No. Here? No. Can you please clench your jaw? And unclench. Good. Can you please do that again? Clench your jaw. Good. And unclench. Good. Can you please gently open your mouth? Wide, 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 wide. Okay, good. Close. And now I'm gonna need you to do the same thing. Open your jaw. Good. So I don't feel or hear any clicking sound, which is good. And I'm going to check your jaw on both sides. Can you please open your mouth for me? A little bit wider. Good. I'm not seeing anything in the back of the throat. Okay. Good. Go ahead and close. And what I'm going to do now is I'm going to check your eyes. Um, can you please look straight at my nose? And I'm going to flash a light in your eyes, check your pupil reaction. So pupils are round and reactive to light and accommodating. Can you please cover one eye? And can you please tell me how many fingers you see? One. Good. Two. Good. Five. Excellent. Let's go ahead and switch eyes. How many fingers do you see? One. Good. Five. Good. Three. Perfect. Okay. Now I'm going to cover one eye as well. Can you please tell me when you see my fingers in your field of vision? Now. Good. Now. Good. Now. Good. Let's go ahead and switch. Tell me when you see my fingers. Now. Good. Now. Good. Now. Great. Okay. Alright, I'm going to check your ocular nerve. For that, I'm going to have you look behind me at the wall and you can breathe normal for this, okay? Just keep your eyes open. Okay, can you please look up? Good, now go ahead and look straight behind me again. Good, can you please look down? Going to lift your eyelid. Okay, perfect, and I'm going to check your other eye. 
So go ahead and look behind me. Okay, can you please look up? Okay, and I'll go ahead and look down. Okay, and I'll go ahead and look behind me again. do is I'm going to check your taste and your smell. Can you please identify this taste for me? I'm going to put one drop on your tongue. Um, orange? Okay. Yeah, that's perfect. Let's go on and try one more. This one will definitely be different. sugar and syrup, very sweet. Okay, perfect. Okay, this one will be a little bit saltier. I hope you don't mind. Yep, very salty. Okay, perfect. And what I'm going to do now is I'm going to check your smell. Okay, go ahead and close your eyes and just tell me what this smells like. Coffee. Excellent. Alright, let's go ahead and do one more. Can you please tell me what that smells like? Lemon. Okay, good. And I'm going to do one more. You got all the answers right. That's perfect. Let's go ahead and check your hearing next. So I will be playing with a tuning fork. I'll create a vibration sound and I'll put it right here behind your ear on the mastoid bone. Can you please tell me when you don't hear the sound anymore? Now do the same thing on the other side. No. Wonderful. Okay. Can you please tell me which position here is louder? This one? Or this one? The second one. Great. Was that too loud? Was that bothering you? Not bothering me. But okay. Just loud. This is position number one, and this is position number two. Yeah, number two. Wonderful, everything sounds good. Okay, so let's go ahead and check your um, neurological responses. Okay, so what I'm gonna do now is I'm going to check your reflexes. Go ahead and relax for me, please. Good. Good. Okay, go ahead and cross your legs for me, please. Good. 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 Excellent. Okay, can you please squeeze my fingers? Wonderful. Okay, can you please put your arms like this for me? Wonderful. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to try to close your fingers, so keep them like this spread out. Don't let me do that. Good. Good. Okay. Go ahead and relax. And I'm going to try to open your arms. Don't let me do that. Good. I'm going to try to close. 
close them to let me do that. And I'm going to try to push them down to let me do that. And I'm going to try to push them up to let me do that. Okay, perfect. Go ahead and relax. And what I'm going to do now is with your legs, I'm going to try to lift your foot up to let your leg up. Don't let me do that. Good. Same thing on the other side. Good. And now I'm going to try to push it down to let me do that. Perfect. Same thing. Perfect. And now I'm going to try to lift your lower leg up. Don't let me do that. Good. Same thing on the other side. Good. Okay. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to ask you to lay down um, with a face down on the pillow. And I'm going to examine your back and see what I can do for you. Okay? Okay. Thank you. Great. Okay, August. Are you comfortable right now? Yeah. Perfect. I'm going to start by examining your cervical spine and also your occipital lobes Moving down to the thoracic spine. Okay, so you're saying that the pain is more on the right side, um, right? No, it's on the left. On the it's left. Numbness. Okay, and is it very close to the spine? Yes. Okay. And is it right here in between your shoulder blades? Or a little bit lower? A bit lower, a bit more to the left. Yeah, it's right there. Okay. Okay, so what are you I'm going to do is I'm going to do some spine manipulations and that will definitely help with uh, the numbness that you're describing. What I'm guessing is that there's a pinched nerve right here and it's radiating more to the left. So first we're going to massage the area really well, make sure that we increase the blood flow.
can you take a deep breath in and hold it one two three breathe out okay can you take a deep breath in again and hold it from one two three exhale okay breathe normal for me please Going to press just a little bit harder. Make sure that we activate the fascia as connecting your muscles that are closer to the spine. Okay, I'm gonna need you to take a deep breath in. One, two, three, and hold it. Okay, breathe out. Take a deep breath in. And exhale. Deep breath in and breathe out. Okay. Okay. I'm going to lift your shirt just a little bit up and we're going to work on your middle back.
find that super painful. Okay, wonderful. So I'm gonna have you sit back up and let's go ahead and discuss the results. Okay, wonderful, honest. So I was able to really feel your back. Um, I did feel some cracks over there. So I think now you're going to experience a lot less pain on the left side. Um, in regards to the temporal mandibular joint uh, pain that you're having, trigeminal neuralgia, that is something that uh, a neurologist could definitely uh, prescribe something if you are looking for some pain relief. Okay. Otherwise, I do recommend a night guard once you're able to wear one yep. uh, because it really helps with you clenching your jaw. Um, I know because I do that a lot too, So, and it really has helped me tremendously. Okay. Um, what else you could do is to put um, either heat or cold, so you could alternate yep. in between them and just put like heat or cold right here where it hurts the most. And that will definitely bring down the inflammation of the nerves. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. Do you have any questions for me? No. Okay, great. Thank you so much. Thank you. See Bye. you back soon. Bye.